it's Delisha and today I'm going to be doing a quick unboxing and first impressions of the Serenity key holder. So I saw this on Facebook a few times and I was like this thing's absolutely gorgeous and for those who don't know what a key holder is it just simply holds your keys but like in a fancy little leather packaging. So this is currently how I have my keys set up. Got some self protection, got my car key, got just random keys all over, straw for on the go. So I just got it in the mail today. So let's open this. And I got mine customized. So in total, it was like $50. But you know, support your local business small businesses and it's, it's not local it's from Canada but support your small businesses you know it was just like super cute and I tried to find like a cheaper similar thing on Amazon just because I first of all didn't even know that like specialty key holders were a thing so when I saw the ad for this brand on Facebook I wanted to see if there was a cheaper option that was just as cute and I was not able to find this got little tissue paper that has like their logo and stuff on it a little handwritten card it says thank you for your love and support all and it's got my name on it um let's see you are absolutely amazing thank you so much for your support of my small business as an independent cracker your purchase means the world to me i hope you'll enjoy your leather piece that it brightens your day and brings a smile to your face. I'd love to hear your thoughts once you've got your hands on it. I truly appreciate you and hope you have a wonderful day. Love from Serenity Canada, Lynn. Aw, that's cute. See, the little personal touches, you know? It means they care. So it comes in this very fancy box. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff, okay. Um, there's just some info on the back here about the leather it looks like. So for most of our products, the leather we use is 100% veg tan waxy leather. It's a unique kind of leather. Let me take this off. Um, it's a unique kind of leather with a whitish wax layer finish. The wax layer will wear and patina over time exposing more and more of the beautiful color beneath you may notice some small marks and scratches in the white coating and they will fade over time with use the original color of the leather will gradually reveal and acquire a bright sheen as you use it which makes the leather completely unique to the owner personalized leather. so i just got my name and then like a little dot on this because you could pick from a couple of different like characters that had like a heart or um different variations of dots or like a plus sign because I guess if you like were sharing the keys with someone you could do it like that. I like this tissue paper. I really like tissue paper. I'm never in a place where I'd be exposed to it much but when I do I like a little fancy tissue paper so it comes wrapped up like this. Got the little protection padding. This is that again monogram tissue paper. It says Serenity. Ooh. Tips: Having trouble putting keys in? Check out the YouTube. I recommend checking out Finding Post of Key Organizer and Screws uh, and tightening them at least every other month. Oh, just to make sure that it doesn't fall apart. Keep the leather away from water for at least the first three months to allow the leather fibers time to soften and absorb oils to increase its natural water resistance. Do not use a blow dryer on the leather and do not store the leather in an excessively hot area. It's a good thing it's cool in Arizona now, not summertime. Scratches are inevitable for veg tanned leather and they will fade over time. Okay, so that one says veg tan and this one says veg tan. I'm assuming it's the veg veg tan leather is incredibly durable eco-friendly and ages beautifully with your usage but only become more unique the longer you have it okay not an issue so this here 
Um, so it comes with a little screwdriver and then a little extra key ring, which you're, I think, supposed to put the car key onto. It doesn't fit in this. A little pouch says Serena key. Again, I got this customized with my own name on it. Ooh. So with the customization, you could either just get it like embroidered with the gold. So just got deletion and just a little dot. I don't know. I always like those little dots. Um, or you could just get it where it's just like a darker color of like what the overall color is. So it would just be like a darker purple here instead of the gold. But I went with gold since the accessories, regardless, like these um, these metal parts come with gold. So it's just like it just makes sense that this. And I guess if it fades over time, you know, it's still a look. So this is just kind of what it looks like. So you put your keys on here and I think it says it can hold like nine keys total because you have the ring on both sides. So four and four and then this is supposed to hold another one. It's so cute. It's pretty stiff, which I don't know. I don't know what texture I thought it would be. I mean, it's smooth because it's leather, so that's that. But I don't know, I thought it'd be softer for some reason, which I guess wouldn't make sense because how is it gonna hold your stuff together if it's soft, so duh. Okay, so this is just what it looks like open. Okay, so you have to unscrew it here. Unscrew it there to put your keys on. Hello, something just fell in my kitchen. Okay, so I have a lot of keys here. 90% of these I don't use, but I keep them on me anyway. Uh, which one's the house key? This one. So this is my main important ones. So. Because this has been kind of irritating me. Just, it's just a lot. It's loud. It's dangly. And I'm just like, ugh. Just, you can hear me coming like a mile away. Never sneak up on someone if I needed to. Not that I sneak up on people, but if I wanted the option, you know, I should get the option. Um, mailbox key. I guess I'll just turn. I don't have that many keys, so I guess I'll. I really, I truly don't know what this key is for. Literally, no clue. No clue. I feel like it just appeared there one day. Couldn't tell you what it opens, but I got it. Uh, I, don't know what this, I don't remember what this pink one's for either. Anybody else just have random keys that you don't know what they unlock, but you got them? No? Just me? Okay. Um, okay, so these could go... This is a little, like, tassel gift that I got from one of my old patients in my pediatric home care. Um, her grandmother gave this to me, they're native, and it was a little gift that she gave me for taking care of her granddaughter, and I miss them. Hope she's doing well. Okay, uh, I think that's all I'll transfer for now, and then I got my car key. So, little screwdriver, oh that's so cute. Alright. Righty tidy, lefty loosey. Does this come all the way out? Nope. Okay, so it just popped out. Just like that, you unscrew it just enough to get the um, little strips here. I don't know if you can see them. Oop. You unscrew it just enough to get those out. So, on this side, I will do the house key.
Okay. So. Okay. Those two. Okay, we'll just do those two on that side. Damn, hold on. Wait, why is this more tricky than I need it to be? back up. There, so now I just got those two and then I'll put these extra keys on this side because I never use them. I know what they're for, so when the day comes they'll be ready. But in the meantime, I'll keep my main keys over here. And to the left, make it loose. Throw these on here. I love little things like this, just random stuff that most people don't have. That's like what I want my aesthetic of life to be is a collection of things that most people do not have, but they're like cute. So that when they see them, they're like, why don't I know about this? And I'm like, I don't know. Why don't you know about this? That's, that's life goals for me. For everyone to just be like, I need this. Where'd you get it? And I'm like, I got the hookup. Let me tell you. I don't know why I can't get this in the hole. There we go. Okay. Tighten it up. So, when you close it up, you just put the keys inside, put the strap around, buckle it down, and there's your keys. So, I'm, oh, it's sticking out a little weird. Did I do it wrong? Maybe I did something wrong, not sure, but that's kind of how it, yeah, it's still loud. Not as loud as before, but I still hear this coming. I'm gonna throw these on. Sorry, this just keeps falling. I didn't come prepared. Um, let's see, so I put this on this key ring here. The quality of the metal on this is pretty solid. I don't know what kind it is. It's like brass, I guess. It's gold plated, but I'm pretty sure that's not real gold. There's no way. I can't get this one because it hurts my fingers. Okay, this on here with this. Always keep your self defense on you. And we're ready to go. Okay, those two on this part here gets hooked on to um, this I guess. I don't think it matters. So there's the total of everything. Still kind of bulky but very cute. Much cuter than the carabiner 
that I had before. That one it also comes with this little leather shot. I don't know what this is supposed to go to, but it comes with this as well and a little ribbon. All right, so that is the Serena key, key holder that you can get customized. Again, got my name on it. Very cute. This was 40 bucks. Shipping was pretty quick. I think it only took like a week from Canada. Um, I don't think it was free shipping. I think shipping was like six bucks, but that's fine. I like it. It's cute. All right, guys, I will see you in the next video.